starting a daily vlog. That's right, I'm doing a daily vlog. The reason why I'm doing it is because I want to challenge myself to do something that I can continuously do for a while and stick to his schedule. So it should create some discipline, which I guess is part of the resolution. The point of a resolution is to improve yourself. Look, uh, we just moved to Chicago a couple months ago in July of this year, 2000, or last year, well, 2016. I've always liked Chicago and, um, you know, visiting from St. Louis and when I grew up in St. Louis, Missouri. Um, so it was always nice to just kind of visit out here and just see the sights and walk the streets and just basically go anywhere, go shopping, go eat some food, just look at the buildings and tall buildings and so forth. Now we live here, which is awesome, which is crazy because we wouldn't have thought we were going to live here in a long time. Um, I never thought about that, but we are, and we live downtown. So it's going to be like part vlog showing um, parts of Chicago that I find interesting or maybe showing specific shots of the city that I think looked like cinematic or just whatever, pretty, anything like that or just something interesting. Hopefully that'll make it more interesting of a vlog. I might finish each episode with like drawing something, just like doodling something, maybe current event or something like good that happened in the news that day just to kind of make it more relevant. And then, you know, this will kind of serve as like a diary, video diary, I guess you could say, for, you know, things that I do. If we were all wiped out, you know, in some, you know, cataclysmic event and all they found was this camcorder and <laughs> Unfortunately, this would all, you know, be all the record they would have of our existence. That would be pretty bad, but at least they might be entertained. Who knows, you know. So hopefully I'd become better at it. I do something more fun, you know, throughout the year, more interesting than today. We're just going to be kind of hanging out watching Star Wars movies, because that's what we do and drinking mimosas, because why not, you know, why not. So it should be fun. We'll see. Hopefully you guys like it. If not, oh well. January 1st, 2017, and we're walking back from the fireworks in downtown Chicago here. Mine's like super loud. It's like a breaking in the middle. It's a silent disco. Spontaneous flash mob? Never heard of this. Shake it! There you go! The star's gonna be over there somewhere, beyond this building here, so. A lot of people starting to pick up! Go, dude. We have a tradition in Chile, at least. I don't know if any other countries have you heard of any other countries. Well, we have it at least in Chile that you have to eat 12 grapes at midnight. It's for like good luck or good fortune or good health or something like that. I can't remember. I'll have to look it up. Maybe I'll put it in the video. Eat 12 of them, one representing a month. So 12 months in a year, I think. Less. Oh my goodness. Eat. <gasps> Running out of English juice. Oh my God. So it's a, it's a Spanish tradition, like from Spain, then. So, miso soup.